identify a feature particular to a characteristic of the Bolt family. Note that the way in which the genotype is expressed is its phenotype. In the example shown, mice with the genotypes BB or BB will have the phenotype black-eyed color. BB represents homozygous dominant while BB represents heterozygous dominant. The genotype BB represents the homozygous recessive trait. Let's see what genotypic ratio and phenotypic ratio would result if two mice from the first generation selfed. Sickle cell anemia. A similar principle would be applied if predicting the results of crosses for genetic disorders such as sickle cell anemia and albinism. Let's take sickle cell anemia for example. This is a condition in which the afflicted individuals are unable to transport oxygen to their tissues properly because the molecules within red blood cells that carry oxygen molecules of the protein hemoglobin are defective. When oxygen is scarce, these defective molecules become insoluble and combine with one another, forming stiff, rod-like structures. This results in the formation of sickle-shaped red blood cells. In this case, individuals who carry one allele for normal hemoglobin and one for sickle cell hemoglobin are carriers and are said to have the sickle cell trait. Individuals who are heterozygous for the sickle cell allele are generally indistinguishable from normal persons. If two persons with sickle cell trait have children, there is a one in four chance that their child may have the disorder. Incomplete dominance. Not all alternative alleles are fully dominant or recessive in heterozygotes. Sometimes heterozygotes individuals do not resemble one parent precisely. Some pairs of alleles produce instead a heterozygous phenotype that is intermediate between the parents. In other words, blending occurs with the alleles. In impatience, bombs, the flower petal is red, white, or pink. However, there are only two alleles, red and white. The heterozygous condition is pink. Multiple alleles. So far, we have examined situations in which a gene may only have two alleles. Sometimes, however, there may be more than two alleles that can occur at a given locus. Of course, in any one individual, only two alleles can be present. A clear example of such multiple alleles is provided by the alleles controlling the ABO blood group system in humans. The ABO system is controlled by three alleles, A, B, and O. The A and B alleles show equal dominance with respect to one another, i.e. they are co-dominant. But each is dominant to the allele O. If two group A parents who are heterozygous mate, there is a possibility that one of their offspring will belong to group O. Now see if you're able to complete this CSEC examination question 2007, biology paper 03.